time is uh, 5.30. It's time to uh, go to work now. Scissors found in the podium drawer, confiscated and removed. Perimeter, barbed wire, holder located near the entrance of the Sheriff's Park parking lot. Second from the corner bank, unable to straighten by hand. This came in for, for murder. He's housed in his book in Lomax Watch. Got some cash and lose. Two Charlie Seven lost one hour wreck, excessive tissue. Right now it's uh, 557. I'm about to go into a Bravo pod right here, take over posts from the officer, and we'll go throughout the day and I'll explain more and more of what I'm doing every time we do something. Right now, what we're doing is I'm relieving uh, Officer Benton right here. He's going to pass on the events of everything that took place last night. All right, we got all your equipment here. We got uh, upper coming out today, upper and then lower. Head count of 89. Today is Wednesday, so you do have uniforms. Your runarounds are Thompson out of two and Gettings out of six. And, uh, one confinee, which comes off tonight, and everything else is normal. Yeah. Mr. Anthony, Mr. Hernandez, Mr. Hernandez, Mr. Hernandez, Mr. Hey, good morning, Bravo Pod. Again, I'm MCO Ward. We're gonna go over uh, what's expected for the day. First of all, whenever we come out for rec, all of our stuff will be in our gray containers before we come out. Beds will be made up. Next off, most of y'all been in here for a little while. We got a uh, copy of the MA rules right there on the wall. I don't think I have to go over uh, all of them, but I will go over the most important ones. Tidiness is the key today. Whenever it's quiet time, we will remain quiet and on our own bunks. That means no games, no talking, none of that. You will be on your bunks. You can read a book, but that's about it. Other than that, we're going to have a uh, pretty good day in here. We're about to uh, kick off morning cleanup, so uh, any questions and concerns about this will be addressed during your rec time. If you need any request forms, pencil sharpen, we do it during our rec time. Other than that, the only time you should come up to my podium is unless it's an emergency. Everybody tracking on that? Okay, hey, at this point in time, we're uh, finishing up a morning cleanup. The, uh, if you notice, the uh, gates are going to uh, be unsecured during this whole process. The only times these gates stay unsecured is if uh, it's uh, cleanup, count time, and uh, mail time. Other than that, the gates are going to uh, stay secured. And uh, this is a facility we manage by walking around. You got your uniform already? Like I said, just uh, always keep check on the uh, common areas, only because that's, that's where they like to hide stuff a lot of times. And right now, we just finished up our morning cleanup. We gathered our laundry and everything. Next thing is, and we'll go around, do another security check. Make sure uh, I still got 89 people in house. Gonna uh, secure my gates. And then you'll see me throughout the day. I'm gonna continue doing my security checks because that's what we do here. We manage by walking around. Okay, upper tier, it is now nine o'clock. You have the uh, first wreck of the morning. Same things apply as my briefing this morning. And no time will we cross my yellow line right there. If you need me, I'll acknowledge you and then I'll come to you. Two, before we come out, all property must be in your gray bins. It must be in your gray bins before you come out. 
Beds must be made up neatly. Again, we'll go over, there'll be no fighting, no horse playing, no rough playing, none of that. Rules are uh, right over there on the wall. And if, uh, if you can't read the rules, just get me and I will be uh, more than happy to go over the rules with you. Right now we're, uh, we're doing med pass for uh, Bravo unit right here. And what's gonna happen is I'm gonna call out three cubes at a time. They're gonna come up here, get their meds. And uh, we're gonna verify it, me and the nurse, we're gonna verify it with their booking sheets and with the rosters, make sure the right person's getting the right meds. We're also going to uh, make sure that uh, they take the meds, ensure it by checking mouths, tongues, make them lift up, uh, make sure they lift up their tongue so we can uh, verify that they did take the meds and they're trying not to hoard it. Right now we got the uh, food cart in post. You're about to see this how we uh, feed through the day. Our run rounds are uh, our guys that's gonna be feeding. What they're gonna do is when the person comes by, they're gonna grab one tray. I'm gonna be standing right beside of it right there, observing, making sure everything's on the tray so nobody tries to get doubles or whatnot. This is a uh, lunchtime tray for uh, today. If you notice, it's got the bread and everything, the meat under there, the cheese, the cookies, the chips, the condiments and everything right there. And like I said, everything does meet the standards with the uh, nutrition and everything. Okay, this time, since I, uh, I just got done feeding the inmates and whatnot, now uh, usually whenever you work a post, you have to eat on the run. So, so usually what I like to do is bring fruit, vegetables, and you see energy drink and uh, apple slice is gonna be my lunch today. At this time, what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna go uh, conduct a shakedown. That means we're gonna be looking for any contraband that the inmate has. Contraband is anything that's uh, prohibited for the inmate to have, i.e. any kind of weapon, any uh, excess of uh, extra sheets, blankets, or anything that's not permitted by medical. Okay, at four o'clock, that's the uh, last lockdown in the uh, pod today. What we're waiting on now is for our dinner food cart. And uh, once that comes, we're gonna serve dinner to them. Then the uh, runaround's gonna start a, uh, nah, I guess a uh, night cleanup. They're gonna clean up before the other shift takes uh, over and uh, make it look good for them. Okay, right now we, uh, we're about to uh, feed dinner. Same thing uh, as we did with lunch. We're gonna get these guys up, line up, and uh, get them ready so we can uh, finish up the day strong. The leaving officer, Officer Tooley right here. I'm gonna uh, brief him on the events that happened today. We'll uh, pass on all the events that happened today. Today so far, all I had was uh, one loss of wreck due to having an extra sheet, Mr. Lee, in number four right there. Other than that, it was a pretty sweet day. Okay. As you can see, it was a uh, pretty good day in the pod. There were no uh, major incidents. So uh, that's always a good day. Every day that uh, we get to go home unharmed, great day. And uh, the, uh, the good thing about it is I get to get up and uh, at 5.30, I'll be here to do it again tomorrow.